Hi, I am Dr. Ajay Thakur. I am a sports specialist. And uh, this is the story of Ahmed, who is a medical student, a 25-year-old medical student who came to me with a severe leg injury. He was a football player. So as a sports person, I know how important the knee stability is if you want to play sports. So he came to me and he has done all his, uh, being a medical student, all his uh, research about the topic, about his injury and the available options of treatment. And he was very particular uh, to save his native ligament at all cost. So uh, I sat with him and then I discussed all the options and then I informed him about the latest surgical procedures which are available now. Now fortunately, uh, because of technological advancements in the imaging and also a lot of advancement uh, in art arthroscopic techniques, we are now able to save the native ways. We are now able to sacrificing it. So what we normally do now is we stitch it back and then we brace it with a, a suture uh, till the ligament heals. So this procedure what is what uh, I discussed with Ahmed and then he was very happy to know that we will be able to save his ligament and then he, he said yes for the procedure. Now if you look at the ACL ligaments, it's a very uh, painful knee injury and it's a very common uh, injury. Almost like uh, 1.5 lakh uh, ACL injuries happen every year, mainly due to sports and also uh, road traffic accidents. The problem with ACL tear is that it has a very poor capacity to heal. Now, this is the main reason why the gold standard of the main reason why is uh, arthroscopic replacement or we call as reconstruction of the ligament. Now, in a reconstruction, we use hamstring muscles or a patellar ligament or a quadriceps muscle or nowadays peroneal muscle and then we replace this uh, broken stump with this new ligament and uh, which is a painful procedure itself because when we harvest the graft, there will be graft site morbidity and there will be a lot of pain postoperatively. Uh, we, make, uh, we have to make holes in the femur and the tibia and uh, it's quite painful. So what we uh, do now with the repair is that we stitch back the original ligament which is broken and then uh, we brace it till the ligament heals with its suture tape and also we make a lot of holes in the lateral wall of the femur. So in the femur bone we make a lot of holes so that the marrow comes out. So the uh, bone has marrow which is uh, full of stem cells. So these stem cells will allow the uh, native ligament to heal back to the femur. So with that concept, with these new techniques of uh, uh, primary repair, uh, the advantage we have is that since the ligament is a natural native of the knee, there is a lot of uh, good proprioception or balancing and the um, kinematics and the biomechanics of the knee uh, are far advanced than when we do a replacement. So uh, that, that's the basic advantage of repairing the ACL and we are saving the ACL. Also suppose if uh, by any chance he breaks the ligament again, uh, then probably we can go for the replacement. So we have options now. So that's why the repair is always superior. Uh, to uh, a reconstruction. Uh, the only concern with the repair is that it cannot be done in all types of ACL tears. There are particular types of ACL tears which are amenable to this treatment. Now, there are four types of ACL tears when you look at the ACL tears, type 1, 2, 3 and 4, where type 1 is an ACL tear which happens from the femur or is an avulsion from the femur wall. Whereas type 2 and 3 is a tear in the middle segment or uh, middle third and middle uh, middle two third of the uh, ligament. Type 4 is an uh, avulsion in the tibial part. Now these two, the mostly, most commonly the repair is successful in type 1 tears uh, when you look at the uh, nature of the tear. Uh, interestingly, when you look at the emblem of orthopedic, the Nicholas Andre tree, you see a tree which is supported by a stick. So uh, it signifies that the biology, the tree, the root, the stem and the leaves is supported by a mechanical stick. Is supported by a is important and also mechanical stability is important. When we do an ACL repair, we address both biology and stability of the knee and with this one procedure. And what we do in this procedure is we, we use, uh, we, is we, we use our sutures uh, through the length of the broken ACL ligament and we fix it to the lateral wall of the femur 
with uh, absorbable screws and then we make multiple holes on the lateral wall so that the marrow comes out and stimulates with the stem cells. Now this ligament we brace it by passing a 2.5 polyethylene uh, suture tape from the femur to the tibia. Now this procedure is uh, less painful. Also uh, you can mobilize the patient faster. So patient walks earlier, pain is less, goes home faster, A lot of advantages are there. Ahmed also undergone, uh, undergone this uh, treatment. He was very happy after the surgery and uh, post-operatively he did very well. He started running at four months and then he was back to playing football in six months. So although ACL tears can be very painful and distressing, the right surgical procedure uh, can get patients back to the sports again. I feel uh, the best bet uh, is to seek help from an orthopedic surgeon or a sports surgeon who is well versed will, with all the latest techniques of the ligament repair and also one who understands both the procedures and who can offer you uh, the best possible treatment which is available nowadays. Thank you.